Hi guys, this is just a quick video about uh, uh, ANAT A8 upgrades that I made on my printer. Right now I'm printing uh, some wings uh, for the dragon. Uh, let's see, first thing that you need to print is a nozzle, some kind of uh, nozzle. I recommend this half circuit instead of full because you're gonna get much higher uh, air flow into this one. Then you have a push switch, so you don't hurt your fingers anymore when you press it and put the filament in. And you have a filament holder, and this one as well. I put some tape on it because it slides better, so it not get stuck between uh, plastic here. Uh, we have a chain, we actually hold all the cables who go to the extruder. So uh, all the cables go here. It's pretty nice though, and it's go connected to this side. And we have we still uh, we have a second chain going here who hold all the cables for the bed. But keep in mind you have to do some uh, some filaments. I mean uh, some fill here in every single connection because it's not perfectly flat, and it can actually uh, you know um, do it your prints bad because it's not level perfectly. It would maybe move a little bit up and down. I had that problem so. Uh, just a little bit feeling on the side and it will be much better. Uh, we have a um, belt, a uh, belt tighter. This were pretty good. I actually print two of those here. I say I have the second one, but this is much better choice. Uh, frame brace, same. We actually uh, hold this frame much better so we have more stable surface for the whole printer. Still here, one here, one here frame tighter, or how you call it. We actually hold this frame much better. Uh, next, what we have? Uh, we have um, some filament uh, holder. I print this version and this one here. And I collect two of those so I can choose which one you want. And I have one, you know, I don't need to like disassemble it and I put the second one so I can like choose which color that I want faster. Uh, what next? Uh, yeah, and here it's a frame, no, it's not a frame, it's a power supply uh, cover. And I'm still waiting for the switch, so I just uh, apply some switches that I have here. Uh, but it still work, you know, I can press it and shut it off. But I'm still waiting for the full switch. But it actually looks pretty neat. Uh, what more? I'm gonna, doing, I'm gonna do actually uh, a cover for the motherboard as well, but not now, I have no, not so much time. Uh, I print this as well. This is supposed to fit here, and it's gonna be uh, same uh, belt tighter for um, for this line here. So that's it. I'm printing some. I'm uh, printing some uh, wings here for the my dragon. Already do a couple of prints. It actually did pretty pretty good. I'm pretty impressed with the quality. Yeah, I forgot this one to mention here as well. It's a chain. Uh, Chain, um, not the chain, it's a belt belt uh, holder onto this side. With actually, it's mount on this side. Here. Yeah, I forgot to mention as well one thing. I have installed a proxy sensor right here. And I have um, flashed the firmware to Skynet firmware. Uh, it's a 1.1 version. Uh, it was a little bit pain to um, level the bed and everything. Uh, but uh, eventually I made it. It was uh, not that pretty experience. <laughs> a lot of stuff that you had to do. As well, Vortex, this uh, build tech, it's a pretty good and awesome thing. You have to, I mean, uh, I highly recommend one of those. Uh, I buy, uh, brought more in some local shop. It was around, I don't know, 20 euros or something. But it helps so much better with the prints. Because every single print that I have, you know, in the beginning it was stacking pretty good. But eventually, over the time, you know, you have to change the tape all the time, you have to use some hairspray or whatever. But with this, just forget it, you know, just install it and forget about it, you know, just clean it a little bit. Uh, with this, this model plate, take off the, the, the parts that you print and it's over. Uh, yeah, I did the lubrication of the frame as well, a little bit with some uh, uh, lithium paste, but that's it, nothing so much serious about it. And that that's how it is look right now I don't have so much time for do it you know because I'm working but anyway it's a pretty good hobby 
So this is it. Hope you like the video and um, take care. Bye bye.